Hi Preview, I'm Francis Liberan. Today I'll be sharing with you my top 5 wedding gowns. Weddings for me is um, something magical. You know, when you walk down that aisle, you really need to picture yourself. Once the door opens, you know, you do your first step inside the church, you feel the music, you feel the, the energy that the people around you supports you and you feel the love and you're just focused on your groom at the end of that aisle. That's why weddings are very meaningful for me because it's, there's a certain magic and it just happens for a few minutes and I would always tell my brides to cherish that moment. That's why in every weddings that I do, I mean, I'm so honored to be part of their love story. You know, being part of their journey from, from that formal day and that special day is very meaningful for me. For Marika Reyes, I created something bejeweled. So everything from, from their high neck going down, everything is encrusted with Swarovskis and crystals. So I made sure that I played with different sizes of crystals. And during the time, it was such a hit that a lot of my brides really wanted to copy Marika Reyes' gown. For Keabad's wedding gown, so I created something different from the, my usual um, details. So I wanted to make it look like laser cutting with layers of a neoprene just to add texture to it. The challenge with Keabad is she wants to look taller in her wedding gown. So I created something that's form-fitting for her. And at the same time, the train is detachable. She wants it really low back because she wants to emphasize her beautiful back. For Jasmine Meyerhofer, she approached me to do her wedding gown for a special day. So I was truly honored because she's been the top model of the Philippines for the longest time. And it's such an honor that she approached me to do her gown on her special day. Knowing Jasmine, she's been, you know, on the runway and been modeling for different types of wedding gowns. So we created something very simple and ethereal for Jasmine. And I wanted to make it look like an ethereal wedding gown. For Jewel Mish, we wanted to make it something different for her. She, she got married in Europe. So we just did one fitting for her because the time constraint is very tight. So we made sure that everything is perfect for her. She wants the details, she wants the beading, you know, and I wanted to create something that's very meaningful for her. So she wants it a bit of a conservative, but I want it to be more sexy for her. So we, um, we've talked about it in the designing process. So we made a Sabrina cut, but we made sure the back is very low. For Kara Agas, we wanted something very simple for her. So what I did here first for her wedding gown, I created my linear detail. I'm fascinated with lines. So what I did for her wedding gown is low back and at the same time, everything is linear. No florals, no laces, everything is modern. Uh, my tips for my brides who, you know, getting married, I would always tell them that to be just yourself, you know, there's nothing um, better than the, the guests, the, the people around you um, see your personality on your special day. And I would always tell them no matter how bad or how things did not work out, always focus on the good because that day is very meaningful for you and you just don't want to destroy it with a single flower or an arrangement that you did not talk to. That's why focus on the goodness, on the love, on the meaning of marriage. Thank you Preview for having me. Follow us on Instagram and Facebook.